What's up, you crazy motherfuckers? Nah, I'm just kidding. But, uh, you are motherfuckers. Or crazy. Whichever you prefer. Take one. Pick one. I, I don't even know why I said that. So, um, domination on terminal. That's what I'm going to be talking about. It's pretty cool. I'm going to use the intervention, stopping power, sleight of hand, and steady aim. Two of those are pro. You, you pick which ones. Whatever. No big deal. And... Hurrah! This is one of my old videos. My uh, last video wasn't old, if you're a subscriber. If you're new, hi, my name's Ryan. What's up? I also go by system. Whatever you prefer. Um, yeah. Whatever, I, I don't even know where I'm going with this. But anyways, the purpose of this video is to explain the starting of my quickscoping career. As you can tell, Right now, I am horrible. Like, horrible. Like, look at that. Jump shot miss. Not gonna lie, I thought I, I should have had that one. And, ah, knife! Okay, so... I'm gonna give some basic tips on what I find works best when you're learning. Tip number one. Best way to actually learn is to go into um, a free-for-all private match with your friends and on rust and basically just run around trying to quick scope people <clears throat> cuz I go to school and I'm a loser I don't have time to um, designate certain times with my friends like hey buddies let's go on at seven o'clock and we'll uh, we'll talk and you know we'll do stuff like quick scoping and practice quick scoping. I don't, I don't have that leisure. I'm not that cool. I wish I was that cool. But um yeah, I'm an, I'm an engineer, guys. How how cool do you think I am? <laughs> no. I'm just really busy, so I never really have time and I just play when I can. So that's why a lot of the times you'll see in my top left-hand corner it shows me playing by myself, sad and kind of sexual at the same time. But, um, so let's go with tip number one if you don't have friends like me and you're just a loser and play Call of Duty by yourself. Tip number one, as you just noticed, pick up an enemy secondary. By the way, these tips might not work for everybody. They work for me. Whatever. I don't care. But, um, as you can see, I take advantage of this enemy secondary and I just rape the other team with it. But... The reason you want to pick up a secondary is because if you plan on going around a corner, which most people do because corners are cool and going around them is even cooler, um, and you're not good at quick scoping, chances are you might find more than one person around that corner, and chances are you're not going to be able to kill those people, and probably not even one of them because they're just going to aim on you and rape you. They're going to make you their bitch, and no one likes to be made a bitch. No one, well, some people do, but we won't talk about those ones. They're a little, you know, a little awkward in the head, if you know what I mean. But anyways, um, as you can see, I switched back, and I'm doing my uh, tip number two, which is use cover to your advantage. If you, if you rewind, just watch how I... Uh, how I take advantage of this little innocent cart that was right there that holds the luggage. I basically make it my best friend and, you know. So, about taking cover, it's possibly one of the, the best tips you can ever give. Because if you take hard cover like a giant wall or a concrete barrier, they're not going to be able to shoot through it. Like right now I uh, shoot and then I go back behind this wall to reload because they're not going to be able to shoot through that giant wall. I think it's a giant wall. Well I thought it was so either way it's going to be very difficult to shoot from or shoot through sorry. So that's why you take it to your advantage. Now if you go take a shot and go behind a glass window don't expect to start living anytime soon. Make sure your surfaces are hard, like, no, I won't even make that joke, but, um, like, like I said, this is my, um, 
first, like, my, uh, starting out quickscoping, so that's why you can notice a lot of my shots miss. Because I haven't used the intervention that long. I have the green, uh, green t- or no, green. What the hell am I talking about? I have the blue tigra on it, but that doesn't really mean much. That means I've, uh, gotten a couple people in the head, if you know what I mean. Yeah. No, I'm just, <laughs> no, no, no. We'll get out of that. So anyways, you know, I uh, was getting shot at, so I didn't want to call in my pred, because I didn't want to die. And, um, damn it, my, my computer's so, my TV's so loud, so it sets me off when I hear a noise on it. I'm actually just waiting to go play Call of Duty, because I just bought the stimulus pack. And I want to go test out those maps because I have to get good at them so I can show you guys how you should be good at them. Yeah, that, that makes sense, right? But anyways, um, my third tip, I think it is, is your perks. Obvious blue perk. Actually, no, it's not obvious. Um, obvious red perk is stopping power because... If you don't use stopping power, it's really hard to kill people. Even with stopping power, you get, uh, what's it called? Those, those things that aren't good, uh, hit markers. Yeah, no one likes hit markers. Oh, by the way, before I get back to hit markers, um, we lose this match and I fast forward it at a certain point, but I'm basically just using it as a background, so doesn't matter because you just want to hear my voice anyways because it's pretty orgasmic and it's pretty lovely lovely like a flower <laughs> not really not really but anyways back to hit markers nobody likes a hit marker hit markers piss people off they piss me off they might piss you off they might not but anyways um yeah stopping power slight of hand is a very useful perk because you scope twice as fast or maybe a little bit a little bit less than twice as fast but whatever you scope up you scope faster that's all that matters and green perk use whatever you really want uh, this one I have steady aim I usually use ninja now because I don't like hearing my footsteps it's kind of annoying but uh, once again it doesn't really matter which perk you use so you can uh, you can throw on commando if you want for those special occasions or you can throw on uh, I don't know something else last stand there use that doesn't matter and um, yeah, that's basically all I can say about perks so my other perk not perk god damn it I cannot speak today just just ignore me which would be pretty useless because I'm doing a commentary. I don't want to talk about it. Anyways, uh, last tip is what I was just doing is trying to quick scope from a distance. Because if you're close and you miss your quick scope, you're not gonna live. It's it's not gonna happen. Sometimes you get lucky and are able to pull off two shots. Usually not. But. Um, if you're from a distance, usually you can probably even get three shots off from a distance if you go back and forth, back and forth with uh, a little bit of a quick scoping action. And um, that one's actually a pretty good per uh, perk. I keep saying perk. Oh, well, if I say perk again, just assume it means good idea or something. Okay, so that one's a good idea because if you're away from people they can't kill you that easily but uh, with a sniper rifle you have the advantage of killing them and I got a minute left so I don't know what else I wanna what else I wanna say but basically best way to learn quick scoping and getting used to it is playing with your friends on free for all on rust or something and you guys just messing around but um like I said it it's not always the case, so when I played and first tried to quick scope and tried to go like all out on my first time, I just got raped and uh, 
I had games where I went like two and twenty, and usually the two came from my secondaries or like a grenade or something like that, something ridiculous. So yeah, those are my um, my quickies, my quick tips that could help you, might help you, might not help you if you ever want to try and learn how to quick scope or anything like that. And also, I am not um, optic, so I'm not amazing at quick scoping. I uh, I carry my own weight, but once again, I do have bad games quick scoping, and I'm not amazing. But uh, thanks for watching, and if this is your first video, come check out my channel. It's pretty cool. Bye.